How's it going out there, everybody? Hope you're having a great, wonderful day. Um, you know, I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start staying up on a channel discussing games that we play. First game we're gonna do is uh, Sons of the Forest. What are y'all thoughts about it? I, mean, I really enjoy it. There's a couple of things I missed from the first forest. If you never played it, I'd I'd recommend it. It is a whole lot tougher, in my opinion. Cave system is a lot tougher than um this one. This one here is pretty self-explanatory. Stay on one track, one trail, and you're good. You, you keep going through, and you're good. Now, the first one was nothing like that. I mean, there were, like, so many turns and twists and curves. I mean, it was, it was bad. I mean, I got lost so many times in the first one. But uh, it's, um, it's a game that was uh, created by N. Knight. And um, the engine used was Unity. But it's it's a really, really fun game. Because like I said earlier, there's a couple of things I wish to have brought back in this game. Kinda I missed the uh log sled. Gosh, I really missed the log sled. <laughs> that is one thing I really do miss. I hope they bring it back. We do have another update coming up here soon, so I really hope they bring it back in the next update. There's a couple of things I really do hope they bring into the update. This is just my opinion. Um the island is so huge. I mean, it's a big island. It takes a while to get around. So I, I would love some f so, uh, forms of transportation. Yeah, I know we have the glider, but, you know, I'm not really a fan of that thing. I can't get to work. <laughs> I'm terrible at the glider. But um, I would love to find some, have them make some forms of transportation. That would be really cool. And I really would love for them to give us a way for, to help Calvin protect himself. Because it seems like Calvin, all that he does when something runs to him is he'll get down like the fetal position and stay there. Or he'll run. That's all he does. And it's really hard to keep, you know, keep him alive during the game. Especially when you get in like, you know, there's like this horde coming up. I mean, it, it gets crazy. So I really do hope they do, do fix that. And also, it's probably be a little bit difficult. I would really love if they left the streams and stuff alone. We can drink out of that because it's running. You know, it seems like it's pretty good fresh water. But where lakes and like staggering water around, if you drink it, kind of like the old one, you uh you get like a, like, like a little poisonous effect on you. Not, well, not effect, I guess. It will take your health down a little bit because you had to boil it first and everything like that. That would be pretty cool. I honestly, that would be pretty cool. But I think that would probably be a little bit, probably too difficult. I don't know. I never developed the game, so I don't know how difficult it is and how n not difficult it is. I really don't know. But Sons of the Forest, though, I, I do. I mean, to me, I rated I rated nine out of ten. And uh, I mean, that's that's my rating for it. It's it's a fun game. It's a very it's an amazing game. It's very amazing. And um, uh, it's like when you play it, you can't stop. You, you don't want to stop playing it. So, it's the only other issue, I, other issue I've seen them having with the game. And it's, well, it's really not, it's really not an issue. It's more of a, it's more of a want. And that is, um, I'm wanting more, like, aggressive animals around. Right now, I don't think we have any aggressive animals. Do we? I, at least I have not ran into any. I mean, the last one, the first one, we had alligators, we had boars, and uh, sharks. Well, we have sharks, but we really, the only way you run into them is in the water. That's pre pretty much it. So, I really wish it would bring something in. Something like in the woods or something like that. I think it'd be pretty cool. But, um, I really enjoy the game. I mean, if you ain't played it, I do recommend, I would definitely recommend it if, it's your, if that's something you're into. And if uh, like you, it has peaceful mode, and uh, you has custom mode where you can actually go in there and fix things where you want it. It has hard, I believe hard, or normal. Yeah, I think it goes peaceful, normal, custom. Now the old one used to have like hard, hard survival and stuff like that. But um, it's it's really amazing. I like it. The graphics are great. I love that we have a companion now. Well, actually, two companions. We have Virginia, which is a big help when it comes to uh, when the uh, mutants and the uh, cannibals come to your camp. She's a big help. You just got to keep an eye on her. She takes a little bit more damage than uh, Calvin can, but you still got to keep an eye on them so they don't fall and get hurt. Then Calvin, 
Oh man, I tell you now, it's it's a relief having somebody, you know, especially single player, somebody help you cut down trees and gather rocks, sticks, and stuff like that. I mean, cause I mean, it's a, it's a long, long, long job, it really is, because you're trying to focus on getting a game done, but you want a base, but you need a base that's gonna protect you. But now with Calvin, it's like it, it's amazing. I mean, he you can send him off to gather or whatever, and uh, well, sticks, rocks, logs, always have him getting like logs. In the beginning, gathering fish. I mean, that's amazing. He's the best fisherman ever. But I'm re I really do enjoy the companions we get in this game. It's pretty awesome. I love the, I love that they brought Virginia in. I love that they brought Calvin in. I, that's amazing. I hope that never changes. If they ever make another of a uh, forest game, I hope that never changes. I hope that does stick with the games. But uh, I, I do. The only downfall is I wish there was a way to get Calvin to help help Calvin protect himself. And uh, other than that, I really have nothing really bad to say about the game itself. Like I said, my opinion, I really wish they would bring some transportation in, some forms of transportation, like uh, golf carts. They're laying around, but like have like parts we gotta find, and make a way we have to make fuel or something. That's perfectly fine by me. I mean, it could be a bicycle. I don't care. Some forms of transportation help us get around a little bit faster. Cause I mean, it's it's um it's a slow progress to get from one from one end of the map to the other, and by the end, especially when you make videos, I mean it's a long. You have to edit like fifteen twenty minutes out just walking. I mean that's real life time, not nothing game time. It's real life time. It's it's, it's crazy, but um, other than that, like I said, I ranked the game nine out of ten. Because, I mean, it beat my expectations. The only reason it's not 10 out of 10 for me is be how long it takes to travel. I mean, I just wish there was a way we could make something to travel, make our travels a little bit better. Like I guess I know we have the glider. I'm not really into the glider. I, mean, people like, I know about people like, don't complain, we got a glider. I understand that. But there's people like me out there who don't like the glider. <laughs> you know, and uh, we want something different. So that'd be pretty cool. But I really hope y'all enjoy this. Like I said, it's going to be a game discussion. Talking about games I've played or new games coming out. I think it's going to be interesting. And I really hope that, um, that you know, they continue with this great content coming out almost. It's like 14 days, I believe. They've been doing updates. So I really hope to continue doing this. Because this is a fun game. And I, I would love to see it succeed. You know, just gratefully. I would love to see it succeed. Because it is, it's, it's amazing. I really hope everyone y'all having a great day. As always, stay awesome. God bless. Peace out.